I'm out here today pulling a lot of my Browning trail cameras and repositioning some of them. I run trail cameras year round, but not nearly as many during the off season as I do during hunting season. Right now, the strategy is to get them over food sources, your food plots, your feeders, things like that to get an inventory of the bucks that made it through season and know what you're gonna hunt next season. But what I wanna talk to you about today is things you can do to extend the life of your trail cameras. I've got probably 25 Browning trail cameras and some of them go back to 2013. And I know that because every year I get one, I'll write down what it is, what year, 2015 in this case, and this was a strike for. So I keep record of every camera I've got by just writing it on there. But things that I do, when I'm taking them down and I'm storing them for the off season, the first thing you wanna do is take the batteries out. There's nothing that can go right if you leave your batteries in there. You know, I've had a couple guys say, well, something's going wrong with my trail camera. And so they bring it to me and I take a look at it. And sure enough, they left the batteries in when they stored them and it's completely corroded in there. All the connections are, are destroyed and it uh, is not good. So take your batteries out. The other thing, take your SD card out. Don't leave anything in your camera that doesn't have to be there. So I take my batteries out, I take my SD card out, and then we're gonna use this strap. Instead of just letting your strap hang like this, which is an un unorganized mess, let's go ahead and protect the camera with that strap. So take your strap and pull it all the way through where it's just your buckle hanging out there, and then take the rest of this strap and just wrap it around everything that's important on the front. We're gonna protect the lens, we're gonna protect the flash, the glass of the flash, and we're gonna protect the sensor on there. So if we just do this, wrap it around there, and everything is completely protected. And then just cinch it through here. And then there you go. Practicing these simple steps will add years to the life of your trail camera. If you'd like more information on Browning Trail Cameras, visit browningtrailcameras.com. I'm Derek Dernberger with The Break. Thanks for watching.